Someone's lit a burning bat symbol on the Gamby store rooftop. A beacon or a threat? Time to find out. I trust you have not forgotten me, bad man. Azrael. Dark days are here, bad man. The prophecy has come true. From the ashes of Arkham City, the fires are raging, and Gotham is burning. What do you want? I can see that same fire in your eyes. Before this night is through, that fire will consume you. Gotham will need a new savior, a new guardian, a new Batman. I'm not finished just yet. You cannot carry this burden forever. I have studied you for a long time. You have a code. You will not kill. Then neither shall I. The Order has foreseen it. The time has come to pass the mantle to another warrior. To me. If you can prove your abilities, when the time is right, I'll consider it. But first, you must show you are worthy. As you wish. This was just the beginning. There are more challenges ahead. Contact me when you're ready. Sir, I've captured Azrael's performance. Good work, Alfred. Run the usual physiological tests. Then am I to understand you're considering him as your successor? None of us know what will happen after tonight. I'll be in touch.
I am ready for another challenge. You have shown great skill. I'll return when you're ready for the next challenge. No matter how difficult the test, I will prevail. Another competent display, sir. He was clearly studying your techniques closely during his time in Arkham City. Initial tests show he is employing an almost identical fighting style to your own. It takes more than that to defend this city, Alfred. Agreed. I'll collect the data from this encounter and compile it with the first. Let me know if you need anything else, sir. Batman in the 
Malcolm Knight go toe to toe. Challenge me again, Batman. I am ready. You're a competent warrior, but one final challenge awaits you. Contact me when you're ready. Be prepared for my victory when I return. He's nothing if not persistent, sir. Huh? You still don't seem convinced. Just keep compiling the data, Alfred. It might interest you to know I've been researching the insignia on Azrael's armor, and it appears to bear the motif of the Sacred Order of Saint Dumas. The Order dates back several hundred years. They have a sworn mission to protect Gotham, but records are scarce, with many speculating their existence was nothing more than a myth. Good work, Alfred. See what else you can find. Without me, was it? I mean, Scarecrow's the biggest bad guy in town. <laughs> I am ready to face your final challenge. It's the toughest yet. to be commended, Azrael. You have passed the test. I will contact you when I have made my decision. There is no decision to make, Batman. I am ready now. I decide how this works, not you. Every moment you waste, Gotham falls deeper into the abyss. Make your decision fast, or she will be lost forever. Sir, we have a positive ID on Azrael. His real name is Michael Lane. He was a GCPD officer before he was dismissed due to psychological issues. And then, well, he seems to have disappeared off the face of the Earth. That must have been when he was recruited by the Order of saint Dumas. It gets decidedly more peculiar, sir. The bad computer has picked up an irregularity in Lane's physiology. I've not seen anything like this before. Upload the data to the clock tower. I can analyze it from there. Right you are, sir.
What do you think we'll find in Azrael's brain, Bathy? Who knows? Maybe there's an evil court jester in there. <laughs> Identity confirmed. I'm sending over the data on Michael Lane now. I'm no neurologist, sir, but I can quite confidently assert that doesn't look like it belongs in one's brain. It's a surgically implanted microprocessor interfacing with the temporal lobe, the region of the brain used for storing and accessing memories. Which memories, sir? Visualizing now. Azrael, protector of faith, defender of purity. The Order of San Dumas has safeguarded Gotham for over 500 years. And it is your sworn duty to continue our legacy. You have studied the Dark Knight for years, learning his every strategy, analyzing his every tactic, perfecting his every move. Now it is time to complete your mission. Seek out the Batman. Prove that you are his worthy and trusted successor. Only when you have won the Batman's trust will you be able to fulfill your destiny. His intentions do seem pure, sir. Are you suggesting these recollections have been tampered with? I am. Alfred, I know this symbol from Arkham City. It's the Order's sacred language. They've implanted markers into Lane's memories to modify his behavior unconsciously. If I can find the other markers, I'll be able to reconstruct the waveform and reveal the message. Scanning that marker has reconstructed part of the waveform. It's working. Another portion of the waveform has been restored. Almost there. There's probably one more marker to find and scan. That's it. The waveform is complete. This should reveal the message. The Dark Knight stands in the way of our cause. He prevents the evil of Gotham from facing true divine justice. When you have proven yourself, wait for your moment and then strike him down. Take your rightful place as Gotham's new guardian. A guardian wholly willing and relentless in his quest to protect this city. They certainly don't mince their words, do they, Master Bruce? How will you stop him? He won't. Lane. Lane is dead. I am Azrael, knight to the Order of San Dumas. The Order has lied to you, stolen your free will. Liar! You stand in the way of true justice! We're on the same side, Michael. No. No! I know who I am. I know what I am doing. In that case, the choice is yours. Protector of faith, you know what must be done. The Dark Knight must be slain. Azrael, complete your mission. You are compelled to execute our commands. You 
made the right decision, Michael. I do no one's bidding but God's. The Order must answer for what they have done to me. Lockdown Clock Tower. Authorization, Batman. Thank <laughs> you. 